This is Black Hills Fox Sports, sponsored by the Box Event Center. Hello, everybody. The Citral and Stevens girls basketball team split their two regular season matchups. That's right, Vic, and tonight the Cobblers and Raiders met up for round three in the Sodak 16 with a winner, earning a trip to next week's state tournament in Sioux Falls. The energy inside higher gymnasium felt different than usual. Everyone in attendance knew the magnitude of this game. The Raiders got on the scoreboard first behind a far side wing three pointer from Talia Porter. Brittany Jones on the assist is three to nothing Raiders heading the other way. There's no slowing down Aaliyah Jones. The cobbler senior breezes by the defense and lays it up with her left hand. The Raiders now facing a zone defense on the other end. Finley Love makes central pay from straight on. She cash it, cashes it. Stevens wins an exciting fashion to advance to the state tourney 56 to 39 over central. Over Rapid City Christian, the second seeded Comets hosted three seeded St. Thomas Moore, the two playing for a trip to the Sodak 16. In the third, leading by 11, it's Christian's Benson Kiefer, who lines up a 15 footer. He's long, but Julius Frog gets the rebound and hits the step back fade away. The Comets are up 13. The Cavaliers stay within striking distance. Chase Donnelly drives and kicks to a wide open Peyton Young in the corner. It's nothing but net for the senior. Christian answers right back with a three of their own. It's Simon Kiefer to Wilson Kiefer, who knocks it through. STM kept it close for the Comets secure a 50 to 45 win. They'll play Millbank next Tuesday. Now let's send things over to Vic. Thank you, Andrew. The Mines women hosted Shadron State tonight, and it was Grubby's birthday. A fine mascot. Second quarter, the Hard Rockers morning gray spotted bear gets the ball to Naomi Hidago. She shows up the nice spin move and scores. Hidago turning in another big game tight at 13. Madeline Heiser passes back inside to Naomi Hidago. She hits for two more. Hidago scored 12 points. Madeline Heiser gathers the loose ball, gets into the lane, it hits the jumper. Savea Winfield, Manfield led the way with 13. The Hard Rockers win 53-47. What do you get the mascot that has everything? A win, of course. Great birthday present for Grubby. The Rush at home tonight to take on Savannah on Coda KEV and Weather Night. That is David Stradling out there dropping the opening puck. First period, Alex Aliardi delivers a pass to James Hardy. He fires the shot. Michael Bouillon makes the save. Then we have some pushing and shoving. One nothing Ghost Pirates. Logan Drevich moves in, fires the puck pass Jason Palowski for the goal 16th of the season for Drevit. Some nice passing from Savannah. Britt Peterson fires the one timer. Jason Palowski shuts him down. The rush were able to manage a couple of third period goals, but the Ghost Pirates get the win four to two. Now let's head back over to Andrew. Thanks, Vic. In Sioux Falls tonight, the O'Gorman girls at 21 and 0 hosted Sioux Falls Roosevelt. The winner will face Stevens in next week's state tournament off the steel. Lucy Moore takes it in transition and finds Sydney Turvine, who runs to the corner for an open three. The sophomore knocking it down later inside. It's a wing a coy for the easy layup. A nice pass from her teammate for two. The Rough Riders call a timeout to end the swing of momentum. The O'Gorman faithful on their feet. Then a coy kicks it out to Lucy Moore on the near side. It's smooth as butter. The Knights advance 65 to 31 over Roosevelt. And now let's check with Vic, who has some more scores for us. Thank you, Andrew. Hey, the Spearfish girls, hello, and Callum. They're headed to the state tournament as they knocked off Aberdeen Central tonight in impressive fashion, 72-48. The Hot Springs boys defeated Custer, 60-49. In Region 7A, the Pine Ridge boys defeated Red Cloud, 83-55. Lakota Tech advances to the Sodak 16 with a 60-48 victory over winner. In Region 7B boys, White River knocked off Jones County, 64-47. Phillip moves on to the Sodak 16 with a 64-53 victory over Wall tonight. And Region 7B boys, Faith defeated Harding County 68-42. Timberlake squeaks past Lemon in a good one, 54-53. And Andrew has a couple more scores for us. Yeah, Vic and College Hoops and Spearfish tonight. The Black Hill State men and women both beat Colorado Christian with the men winning 65-56 and the women 73 to 68. Impressive stuff there. Uh, the RMAC uh, Conference Tournament coming up starting on Tuesday. And congrats to the Spearfish High School girls basketball team and the Stevens girls as they're both headed to state. Now tomorrow, Andrew, we have double-A boys Sodak 16 games. Stevens, Sturgis, and Spearfish all on the road. They're going to be playing for a trip to state as well. What did you think of that Central Stevens game today? Yeah, I mean, it just felt like a rivalry game and with all the marbles on the table. Uh, congrats to Stevens. They're going to face O'Gorman 
in the state tournament. All right, also more college basketball tomorrow, Mines and BH, both at home as well as the Rush tomorrow night. That's a look at sports.